Welcome back everyone, this is Jennifer here, the Soap Artist. Today I am making my red apple soap. So the first step I needed to do was extrude the seeds. I am using soap dough, the extruder, and the teardrop piece to make the seeds. If you haven't watched my video on how to use an extruder, go back and watch that because that explains in detail how the extruder works. I need five seeds per loaf and I'm going to be making four loaves so I will be needing 20 seeds. Um, next up I made the stems. This I just made a batch of brown soap and now I am cutting it up into small little chunks and then I'm gonna kind of trim the sides, give them like angle cuts to make them look like stems for the apple. So not hard to do, just a little time consuming. Next up, I am actually now making the batch. So I'm gonna have three layers. The first will be red, the middle will be white, which I will embed the seeds into, and then the top layer will be red again. I'm basically trying to create an abstract apple. that the batch is poured I am adding the seeds on top so you can see I have my mold marked and I am placing them in the center I had set aside a little bit of batter and made that green. Once it was thick enough to pipe, I put it into a piping bag. I used the Wilton Tip 113, and now I am just piping the leaves along the side. It makes, it, it gives it a really cute finished look to the apple, and I love the leaves. I just, they make me smile. <laughs> 